few weeks ago, we were lucky enough to get to meet Natasha Baker, a world-class dressage rider. She's a super girl who really sums up the Paralympic spirit. Hi everyone, um, I'm Natasha Baker, I'm 22 years old and I'm a para dressage rider. I watched the Sydney Olympics in 2000 and it was the first time the Paralympic dressage had been seen on TV and uh, I watched that and I was only 10 at the time and I said that's what I want to do, I want to win a gold medal. I went to the IDA National Championships a year after doing dressage for the first time and I was third that year and then I went back and did it the year after when I was actually 11 and I won the nationals for the first time and it was just incredible. Um, so from there I was talent spotted and put onto the world class program and that's when really my career took off. I started international competitions when I was 15 and then my first cha major championship was the Europeans last year where I came home with two gold medals. Well it's been my dream for 12 years now and I think it, the best thing about it is the feeling that you get when you're standing on the podium in first place with the union flag going up and the national anthem being played with the medal around your neck. It's the most incredible feeling in the world and nothing else will come near it. And uh, that's what I always think about whenever I ride. For my selection this year, there's actually 10 of us that are on the squad and only five of us will go. So it's really, really gonna be 50-50. So I've just got to go out there this year and do exactly the same as I did this year. And um, I've got a bit of pressure because since 1996, when Paralympic dressage first started, we're actually the only sport, able-bodied and para, that have ever been unbeaten. So we've won a gold medal every single year from then. So they will only choose us if they think that we can go towards that gold medal. So I know that if I am selected for the Paralympics, which we don't find out until the 8th or 9th of July, which is only six weeks before, um, if I'm going to be good enough to go. And hopefully, if they do choose me, then I will go out and do my best and hopefully get that gold medal.